So here we are, day 10 of sunshine and plus 10 Celsius temperature anomalies here in Denmark in October 2018. It's reminiscent of the record warm May that we had in Denmark and Sweden. What caused that heat wave in Europe was a persistent atmospheric circulation pattern that set up with a high pressure over northwestern Europe and a low in the North Atlantic that actually brought cold air spring and summer 2018 down West Greenland. So now Greenland is having its most positive year in decades. That's, that's great news for sea level rise. Um, but the, the point is about how Arctic warming is happening faster than the rest of the world that is slowing down the jet stream, making it more wavy, and persistent, very high amplitude waves that go very much north-south, persistent waves like that are a signature of climate change because the Arctic is warming faster than the rest of the world. With climate events like the, the heat wave that we had in uh, spring, summer of 2018, and it's actually the same pattern that we have right now in October 2018, where we have uh, really pretty delightful weather. Uh, no one's complaining in Denmark uh, in October. It should be uh, near the just above freezing this time of year. Uh, but uh, it fits the picture of uh, climate change. Uh, that is to say, even though it's warm in Northwestern Europe at the moment, it's abnormally cold in Greenland, and those patterns are a signature of Arctic climate change.